My name is Mark Dam, a first-year cardiology fellow here at Good Sam. I present a case of leukostasis from CML leading to sudden cardiac death. Leukostasis in CML often presents with neurologic or respiratory symptoms, but has been reported to be a rare cause of sudden cardiac death. Here I present a case of a 57-year-old gentleman with no real significant past medical history aside from hypertension who presented as a trauma after an unwitnessed syncopal event while driving his truck. In the field, he underwent 25 minutes of advanced cardiac light support and eventually was brought in to the hospital and found to have multiple injuries, including rib fractures, as well as noted splenomegaly on CT. Initial laboratory evaluation showed leukocytosis of 197,000 per microliter. An eventual pathology report revealed CML. Given his syncopal event, he underwent a coronary angiogram, which revealed multivessel disease not amenable to percutaneous coronary intervention. Patient was discharged with a life vest with plans for treatment for CML as an outpatient. He underwent chemotherapy with imatinib and following improvement of his leukocytosis underwent coronary artery bypass grafting. This is a very interesting case in the fact that it is the first reported case of leukostasis from CML leading to a sudden cardiac death in which the patient survived the inciting event after, and eventually undergoing treatment for both the CML and the multivessel coronary artery disease. This illustrates the serious and little known cardiovascular complications of a common hematologic malignancy. Thank you.